Wait, hold on. I want to do a cool jump cut. I will see you guys in the overworld! And we're back. Wasn't that a cool jump cut? I have no idea. I haven't edited yet. Maybe it was the lamest thing ever. I'm... <laughs> Life's a gamble. Okay. Let's get nitty gritty. Um... <sighs> okay. Let's just grab a little bit of every block. Um, so these are called stems and not logs, which is interesting. Oh, I am not going to have enough room in my inventory for this. Did they give us stairs? Please. Oh, they even gave us pressure plates? Oh, oh everything. Oh, they have blue torches? How do I make one of these? How? Oh, okay, okay, breathe. Breathe, Tam. We just talked about this. Did I? Alright, I had to make sure I actually started recording. I'm so excited. We have blue torches! Oh, this is... Oh, chandeliers are gonna be so cool! Um, basalt looks really good. Okay, that's just a regular mushroom stand. They gave us gates. They, gave, they did give us stairs. Alright. Alright, sorry about that, fellas. Let's get back into it. What was I doing? Um, the blocks. <sighs> okay, new plan. We're gonna get rid of these real quick. I know, I know, it hurts to look at. Because I actually want to compare some blocks. So, okay. So this is regular grass. Dirt, podzel, crimson nylium, warped nylium, and regular netherrack. I... Oh, I don't like how fleshy it sounds! Okay. Uh... Hmm. It's a lot... more complex than the old grass texture, which is not really expected. And it kind of looks like this. No, because it's paler. I don't know. It sort of looks like the red... Like, the grass is kind of, like, growing in the cracks of the nether act, which I really like. Next, let's compare some wood. My bad, I meant planks. Um, I know that this gives me stacks, but it's just so much more convenient. Okay. Whoops. Ooh. Okay, that looks really nice. Ah, that. Ah, the colors. The colors are so good. Let's not be a heathen. Let's put them in order. Okay. It would be a lot easier if my hands weren't shaking from excitement, but here we are. And then, it also, it looks like they gave us stairs and fences. I wonder if these connect. They do! Interesting. Ah, oh, they look so good. Okay, let's plonk those bad boys down. That's weird, I did not expect them to connect. Whoops. Um, oh, let's get some logs up in here. Hmm. Log, 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 log. I'm sorry, stairs. I'm so sorry. Log and log. Log and, whoops, and log. Oh. Oh, and, okay, so this... They match. Huh. God, it's so pretty. Like, the inside is all purple or blue. Ah. Uh, oh, I'm so excited. It looks so nice. My music is a little bit deafening, though. I love you, Minecraft music. But you are so loud. <laughs> oh, I gotta play around with these bad boys. Got grass, weird grass, tiny grass, and weeping vines. And then we need to test out all of these. No, I'm not, I'm not gonna mess around with nighttime. Okay, so it looks like these can only be placed on dirt-like blocks, which makes sense. And also it's daylight, so they're gonna break. They can't be placed on netherrack or wood. Like, this wood. Interesting. So, or... 
All the I don't know what I was trying to say. I got lost. I really love the little orange bits. It's like they've got lava inside them. Screenshot. Okay. And then does this, I'm guessing, is the same way? It just grows on... Yeah. Oh, I really like these as well. I... I'm not really a big fan of the noise, but I... It looks so nice! And this one is like... It's got like little balls at the end. I like the blue stuff just kind of tends to look creepier, I think. And the tiny sprouts. I actually really like the tiny sprouts. I wish that was something we had. Oh, you just. Oh. I wish that was something we had, like, an overworld version of. Because I feel like it adds, like, a tiny, sort of subtle sense of dimension that's really powerful. And it's nice. Oh, my god. Oh, <laughs> I'm so excited. I know I've said that like 300 times, but it's true! Oh. Oh, these don't place on foliage. They do place on wood, however. Yeah. So, they could just place on any wood. Can I put them on nether wart blocks? Yes, okay. So they grow on wood and nether wart, it looks like? Oh, they look amazing, too. If I turn the tick speed up, do these grow? Hold on. I can never remember. Is it random tick speed? It's normally three, so let's set that to like a billion. You want me to go higher, huh? Okay, yeah, so they are, they are powered the same way regular finds are. That makes sense. I really like that. Uh, glowing vines, glowing mushrooms. This is just... I thank you, Mo Yang. I thank you. Uh, uh, <laughs> and the, the blue torches. Okay, I also want to look at basalt. And, oh, that's weird. They're facing different ways. Okay, let's grab all of those. Um, Any other blocks down here that I should be concerned about? Oh, this is just everything. Whoops. Thought it was in the block section. Here we go. The nether ancient debris. I haven't heard anything about that. Oh. Oh, that looks cool. Oh, it sounds weird. I can't tell whether it looks like a rose. Like, up here is a curly part, and these are the petals. Or whether it looks like a really, really fucked up pillar. Like, it used to be a pillar, but it had a midlife crisis, you know? And do these... No, they do not. They just... They don't follow log rules. Oh, that is a nice texture. Ooh, I really like that. Oh! That's not the normal noise. If I go here, these make this sort of like, yeah, this high-pitched clean noise. These sound more like a lantern. I think I like it. It's a very musical metallic noise. So this is the, the netherite, which is supposedly stronger than diamond. Um... Okay, so these these are actually different. Ooh. Whoops, that was a very loud a very loud car. Ah. I oh, I really like this. I got to know, can you put a beacon on a block of netherite? No. No you cannot. Okay. That's interesting. I wonder why. So Everyone has sort of- okay, hold, wait, 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 hold that thought, I gotta look at this basalt. That doesn't sound like a rock, it sounds like gravel. Hmm. I do really like the texture, though, it looks so coarse. Again, not very basalt-like at all, but that's okay. And I want to know how to get these soul fire torches. They're so nice. I could just look at them all day. <sighs> okay. 
So, the big thing that everyone is losing their minds about is netherite, because... Here, let's just put these in order. Because it is supposedly stronger than diamond. Um, let's grab some diamond. Okay, plus three. Knockback resistance? Oh, and they also have... T they're, t they're tougher. Plus three armor toughness. Plus two. And they have knockback resistance. Interesting. So it seems like... I'm guessing that that means that they just last longer? Has there ever been a toughness stat before, or is that new? Okay, 6.5 attack damage. 5.5. 10. 9. 6. 5. And 8. Versus 7. That's a whole point difference. What's the difference between iron and diamond? I or diamonds is 7. Iron is 6. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, they look cool. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Okay. Ah, they do look cool. Oh, they have, like, little black wrapping around the handles. That's really nice. Let's try this on real quick. Oh. I feel ready for battle. Look at how big the shoulder plates are. I feel like this is, like, the first piece of armor that actually looks... Like, real armor. Like, the way, like, the helmet kind of, like, cups your cheeks and everything. I really like that. I, mm, on one hand, as much as, like, I love this, like, sort of dark, rusty aesthetic, I sort of want a little bit more color. I think that would be nice. It's also, I gotta see if it's true that these don't burn in lava. <gasps> oh my god. Okay, so we're just gonna let that hang out. Oh. Yeah, they just... They just sit there. That's amazing. My... Mm. Oh, do they take enchantments, though? Let's grab protection and an anvil. Okay, grab a piece of armor. There you go. They do! Interesting. Although, I'm not sure whether that's... Like... Huh. Because this... It might say that it has protection, but then it doesn't actually do anything. I know that there are some enchantments that like to do that. Hmm. I just like... Uh, I don't know. As much as I really like this, and I'm probably gonna have to record, like, testing it out on how quickly it kills things versus how quickly diamond kills things and whatnot, and like durability and all that jazz. That's a whole nother video though. I am, hmm. Whoops, oh God. I am very worried about how they're gonna balance this because if it's just as strong as, our, as diamond it has more durability, it has knockback resistance, and it, the weapons do more. Oh wait, what about attack speed? Okay, that's exactly the same. And the weapons do more damage. As like as much as I'm like looking forward to a new ore that is better than diamond, all right, I think that's cool. I'm really, really worried about how they're gonna balance that. Mm, something that happened on Ark a lot on big public servers is there's this thing called like you would have what was called an alpha tribe where they just had like tech armor and they would just KOS everyone else on the server and like you never had a chance and I'm really worried that if we have something that is stronger than diamond like in every way that it might be a little like I just I don't know I feel like that might not balance well. Also, did I put this here? Or did that just grow on its own? I actually don't know. No, I think I did put it there. Okay. Um. Ah, uh, I don't know. I. That, I'm just. I am. A very. Like a. a <laughs> playing Ark, you kind of get paranoid about balancing issues. <laughs> 
After being burned so many times? Let's real quick compare some light outputs. Well, if I can type, good lord! Okay, there we go. So this is a regular lamp. I should have a super flat world for this, but that's lame. So this is a regular lantern. Put a soul fire lantern all the way over here. That definitely looks dimmer. That definitely looks dimmer to me. Let's go over here. Regular torch. Soul fire torch. That one might be the same. I guess I could just actually go down there and check with F3. That might be a smart idea. Client light, 15. 15. Okay, that's not changing. Hold on. <laughs> ah, I don't know. I think with... Let me fly! I think the lantern, though, the soul fire one is definitely dimmer. Yeah, yeah, 100%. Uh, let's try these shroom lights. God, that's a bad name. It looks like they put out about as much as a lantern, which is pretty intense. I re okay, as much as like, I hate the name, I do love the shroom light. Like, glowing mushrooms? This wonderful, like, orangey golden texture. Oh, it's perfect. Shame about the name, though. <laughs> I think that's pretty much everything I wanted to cover. Oh, I'm so excited for this, y'all. I'm so excited. Like, there, there, okay, there's definitely some kinks to be ironed out. Like, I might actually have to submit a bug report just to make sure that, like, they, they know what's up. But it is, this is very, very promising so far. I'm so excited. Oh, you can just live in the nether. You can live in a home in the nether. Dude, the lore. Like, the, the, my potential for world building and making stories has literally doubled because now I have an entire new dimension to do it in. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think that was everything that I wanted to cover. I don't want to drag this out. Uh, I know that, like, everyone and their entire family is currently making Minecraft 1.16 snapshot videos. But, like, I get it, okay? It's really good. <laughs> Maybe they're right. <sighs> but, okay, now I'm just rambling. So, yeah. But, aw. Uh, we'll leave it on. Um, thank you so much for watching. It has been a blast. Um... I cannot wait until the full release. Uh, I also have forgotten my own outro. It's been a while, okay? <laughs> Thank you again for watching. I, I'm, I might actually like record more of these as more snapshots drop. That's not something I normally do, but I'm not normally so excited for snapshots. But uh, we'll just have to see what the future holds. Uh, I, this, I've said thank you for watching like three times, so I can't say that again. I will see all you comrades in the next one.